Initiative is not just getting there first, right? Okay. Um, we need to set the rhythm, set the pattern, make the opponent respond in the way that we want to. But more, like I said, what it re initiative really is is who's responding to whom, right? And you always want to be the person who the other person is responding to, right? If you're not well, you run the risk of being played, right? And of course, that's the whole, you know, the whole point of everything that we do. So, here's what I'll, I'll show you here. So, Rothtar's wheel, which is just the same strike over and over again. So, if we, if Ryan comes up here and he goes to a downward strike, there we go. Okay. So now, okay. So the same. We've got the same techniques going on. So who who gets who wins, right? Because we're both we're just kind of taking turns, right? Now when we practice, that's fine. We start doing that, but then it's it's more like this. So you can see how I, I basically took the initiative away from him by forcing him to respond to me. Now since we're limited to one technique, I have to do that over and over and over again to get him to, you know, lose his technique a little bit so I have an opening, right? Okay. In real play, obviously I don't need to do it that repetitively because I can switch it up, right? So. That's what I mean by taking initiative. Initiative is not just going for the strike, okay? Initiative is not me here just going for his head, right? Because that won't get me anywhere, right? I have to know what his response is gonna be so that I can plan my next move, okay? With these exercises, we do them repetitively so we don't have to add that component in yet. Three of each gets a little bit there where we're starting to throw different combinations of stuff in there, right? But I don't want to just go for that target, okay? Sometimes I want to engage their blade, right? Sometimes that's taking initiative, okay? Sometimes taking initiative is letting them strike. Whoa. You see? So that I am, I've already started my timing. So as soon as he starts moving, I know exactly what I'm going to do. Right? If you see somebody go up, wow, like that, <laughs> you're not going to have a chance because they're starting it before you did. They've taken the initiative away from you. Come down, come, come forward. Oh, okay. Right? Okay. You see? Same thing. Yep. Go ahead. Okay. <laughs> Even that was tough. <laughs> okay? So it, it doesn't really have anything to do. If, 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 if here, if I want to take the initiative from, from that position, he's in a high guard here. Okay? I may want to let him attack. Right? So that I can formulate my, my, my response. Okay. Okay? Maybe. Others, if he's up... If he's up like this, Same strike. right, and I'm and I'm coming here like this, I might be able to rush in and stop his strike from happening. Okay, again, that's initiative. Okay, I don't have to hit him. I don't have to get the point right away. Sometimes beating on the other person's weapon is a way to get them to uh, move forward. Okay, so if I'm here. Go ahead. Okay? If I beat against his weapon, as he comes in, I hit it. You see? 
it will want to go in a certain direction. He will either let it go in that certain direction and turn it into a strike, or it will be out of his control. Right. Either way, I can formulate a plan, right? Okay? Knowing where it's going to go, I know it's going to go this way, right? So I'm going to go there. I don't even have to take it back, okay? So just because we're looking to hit the other person mm -hmm. and our target is the other person, that does not mean that we're never going to engage the blade, okay? Even with these, okay? Sure. Perfect world, we want to hit them without us even touching. Right? Okay, that's fine. That's not going to happen all the time, right? And probably it's going to happen to very few, especially when you're first starting out, and especially when you're just playing around in this game, right? But if you set the initiative, right? You see? I set it by not moving at that point. You see? Because I can come in and he assumes a position, right? And then he assumes another position. So I kind of get an idea of what type of position he's going for. Oh. Right? And then that can be can be used. So if I come in here, you see? Right? Same thing. Okay. I don't have to even move fast, right? Okay? Initiative has nothing to do with any of that. I'm going to control, control the engagement here, right? I'm going to control the distance that you're, at, that you're at. I'm going to control the type of strikes that you want to use, right? Okay? Here. Okay? If I want to. You see? And I can switch it up. Either way, I want to remain on that tip. Right? I don't want to get into this. Or where you just you're ready to just go for an attack. Right? Okay. Don't worry about my blade. Just go, oh, okay. just go to hit me. Okay. Okay? And again. Get. Okay? This is just. You're going to get double after double after double after double, right? I want to take the initiative first, and then I want to catch it in, okay? I don't want to just go in for, for that strike. So if somebody's being really aggressive, right, how do you take the initiative there? Um, let them come in. Interrupt. Let them come in. So as they come in nice and... Okay? Hold okay. your ground. Okay, so he's aggressive. Just come in aggressively. Oh, okay. okay. Hi. Right? <laughs> Hold your ground. Okay? Did you feel in control in that particular. Not as much as I hoped for. Right? <laughs> so that's the thing. Who's got the control? Who's making the other person do what? Mm. Right? When you're doing it in a drill and it's just a repetitive motion, you know what's coming. It's all timing, it's all initiative. Right? It's a very, very hard and uh, subtle thing to get down. Right? Is that taking initiative. And it's not easy to do outside of free play. Right? But it's really hard to do in free play if you don't know what you're doing, okay? It will easily turn into just a game of tag where people are just trying to hit each other first, right? That's why we don't count after blows, right? If you get an after blow, like if you do a strike and they hit you right after, that strike does not count, right? You did not safely make that strike. That was not a successful strike, all right? Especially with a lightsaber. If I hit you and you hit me, we both die. <laughs> right? Very true. So, in this game, 
we don't have any leeway there. Right? So there you go. Um, so yeah, so taking the initiative, using um, three of each, and Rothtar's wheel to, you know, start working with a partner. Because what does all this take? It takes observation. You gotta know what's coming at you. You have to be able to read people. You have to be able to know what you can do from each position, all of these things. So this is one of these core skills, which is trained all the way up, right? This is the very beginning of that, that type of training. It's something that you develop over time, right?